How'd you like a $25 electric bill? Really, who wouldn't? That's right. An Okeechobee County builder is paying that and hopes he'll be able to get it down to zero. How? The power of the sun and new technology which can turn your house into its own mini power plant. News Channel 5 Jamie Holmes explains how you, too, can get a low bill. Another sunny day for John Erickson means another day of saving money. I'm feeding my house with energy that I don't have to buy from them. For a rural home in Okeechobee, Erickson's roof looks a bit space-age. These are actually solar panels, no thicker than a credit card, and they're generating 2,500 watts of electricity. Unlike those traditional solar panels that stick up off of your roof, these are basically glorified stickers. You peel off the back, and then they just stick right to your roof. Those panels laminated onto that metal roofing have a Dade County product approval rating of 140 miles an hour. It's a builder's dream. The panels feed down into Erickson's garage where the electricity is converted from DC to AC. Erickson is able to generate enough power from the panels he can actually sell some of the electricity back to FPNL. So what I'm doing is offsetting my bill. That means Erickson is able to run this four bedroom, 1600 square foot house for less than it takes to fill up his gas tank. It skyrocketed last month to $45. I was a little concerned because the previous two months it had been $25 a month. Uh, but last month uh, the temperature heated up and I've been using my AC. It's not just the solar panels though. Erickson is also using a propane water heater and even has LCD lights which use virtually no electricity. For him, this is just the beginning. He wants a bigger house with a bigger roof and more solar panels which would mean even more savings. If I double the size of my system, I may get to the point where I could zero my bill and that's my goal on the next house.